guys, it's Sally Jordan here, and today we're going to be talking about one of the things I mentioned yesterday regarding two, two gaming event, two gaming things I want to talk about. Now, this is one of the first ones I'm talking about, and this is regarding a tease for a game, and you know, it, it, it really got my attention. Now, I, I just want to talk about it with you guys, you know, give, give my thoughts on it, and, you know, at the same time, give you guys news about what's what's going to be happening. Anyways, um, you know, this right in this picture, you, you can't really tell what's going on, but you know, this is just a tease, so. Let's get ready to talk about it right now. So um, it's a pretty cool looking sword. Sword is kind of big, obviously, but you know that's their specialty. If you know what I mean, and we'll talk about it right now. Dark Side's creator teases new game announcement with new studio. That's right, guys. The franchise I do like, not like, but I love. Um, the creator of the franchise is now have is now teasing a new game announcement with his new studio. So with he or she new studio. Oh wait. It's a guy, okay, with his new studio. So, you know, um, that's really good. I'm really happy that they're, you know, they're coming back together to bring back a awesome title. If I just wish that they can somehow just buy back the IP, buy back the Darksiders IP from Nordic Games. That would be freaking awesome. But, you know, um, you know, I don't know. That, 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 that's, that's just a wish that I would love for it to happen because, like I said, Darksiders is one of my favorite franchises. And the fact that I had such a terrible fate, just, it, it, it's a shame. It's really, it's really heartbreaking. It also saddens me because, like I said, it's one of my favorite franchises. Anyways, let's go on with the actual article. Darksiders creator teases through game announcement with new studio. Joe Madura, I don't know how to pronounce his last name correctly, but Joe Madura, the creator and director of the Darksiders games, formed Airship Syndicate following the collapse of THQ and Vigil Games. He and his new team is preparing to announce something. This is the picture right here. I just had over here. Looks like in his um in his Twitter message he posted. Looks like there's a storm coming. Dot dot dot. Airship sin. Um hashtag teaser. Hashtag dying to tell you. you got a, all those retweets favorites. Madura tweeted out the image you see above writing. Looks like there's a storm coming. Alongside hashtags like dying to tell you. He followed up that tweet saying there's some kind of announcement will be happening in the next few days. Those tweets were on Friday, February twentieth. Joe Bandura, guys, make sure to sign up at airshipsyndicate.com. There's a big announcement coming very soon, like days, not weeks. So, you know, that's that's awesome. Madura and other fig, Madura and other former video games members like Ryan Stef, Stefan, Stefanelli, who served as a producer for Darksiders 2, announced the formation of Airship Syndicate back in September of last year. You can read an interview with Madura and Stefanelli about the formation of the new studio by heading here. So, you know... Like they said, like they just said, you know, this is just, I'm talking about um, Airship Syndicate. A cool looking logo, I suppose. Um, if you guys want to check out this article, I will, you know, leave it in the description. Like I said, I will always leave my articles in the description. This is a lot to read, but you know, I'm not going to read it. <laughs> but I will provide the link in the description if you guys want to check it out yourselves. But I mean, let's go back to the article, shall we? Additionally, this doesn't appear to have anything to do with whatever Madura and Airship Syndicate are working on, but he recently posted this very cool Castlevania tribute piece. Simon Belmont tribute I did recently. Hope to post what I'm actually working on Airship Syndicate very soon. This is on a very. Well, right, so, you know, this, this is a cool looking, cool looking picture, I suppose. Um, just shows a guy with a whip blade thingy with a giant sword, has decked out gear. And, you know, um, the fact that you can you can just tell that they're just um this is like from the dark side is um I don't know but you can just tell this is just from the dark side is creator because I don't know like they just have they just have this little touch that I'm always familiar with like the fact that this sword this, this sword looks like you know extremely big it actually looks like the dark looks like death mags death mask from dark side is still actually the sword if you look at it right there you see the little two little slits inside of it those those could you know be a representation of eyes but you know that's just how I see it. But you know, I can just tell that like, you can just tell that this is by the former Vigil game members because you know, I'm just they're a little touch on it. I'm just familiar with the things they do, considering I'm playing Dark Siders one and two, and I enjoy that game, both of them to the max. So you know, um, yeah, that's it, guys. That's the thing I really want to talk about. Um, um, hold on, I'm gonna I might as well read the hour take from Game Informer. Some are speculating the images teasing something related to Battle Chasers, the comic book series Joe Madura made a name for himself with, but never actually completed. He abandoned the series in 2001 after nine issues to pursue a career in video game design. Frankly, I am up for whatever from Madura and Stefanelli. 
I'm a big fan of Darksiders, and I'm excited to see what the creative team does next. Exactly, like they, like Game Informer said, they are a very creative team, and the fact that Darksiders had such an abrupt ending just really makes me sad. But you know that you know that type of those type of things happen, and we can't you know we can't help it. It's just it's just unfortunate. But you know I'm looking forward to what um, Airship Syndicate now. Airship Syndicate now. Um, I, I'm looking forward to what they're going to announce in the next few in the next few days. They're putting emphasis on Barry, so you know it's going to be happening later on this week. It's only Monday. This news was posted yesterday, so you know, so you know. Um, was it was it posted yesterday? Well, it was posted on Gaming Farmer yesterday, but it was actually made on the announcement of February, you know, February 20th. Okay, but that's besides the point. That's right, point. But um, yeah, guys. Um. Yeah, that's really it. I just wanted to talk about this with you guys, seeing you know, the whole whole thing regarding this um, the new studio and Joe Madera and Stefanelli. So, you know, guys, um, tell me what you think. If you guys would like to, leave a like, comment on what you guys think about this, and subscribe if you feel like you're going to enjoy my content and enjoy any other future things I may upload. I really appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you once again. And, yeah, guys, um, yeah, let's just hope what it is. Let's just see you in the next few days. Anyways, guys, this is Sonwave Jordan here. Peace late and thank you for watching.